Alright guys, BB3 Gaming here with the episode 5 of the Welsh Wizard Road to Glory series that we're doing. In the last episode we managed to go into the non-rare golds um, and we've now included uh, some downgrades, which is what I said halfway through the episode last time. Uh, we're going to have a downgrade if they score a goal or if the opponent wins the game, to try and make the games last a little bit longer. So guys, let's go straight into the games, see if we can get some more goals with Gareth Bale. At the moment his record is 7 games, 19 goals, and he is just absolutely owning the team. So let's go out and see um, if we can carry on winning. Let's go. So guys, our first opponent of the day has a 5-3-2 full goal team, but poor chemistry. I reckon it'll be a hard challenge, but I reckon we can bring it in and get the first win against the gold team, seeing as we actually haven't had anyone good in the past. So let's go. Oh, good defending by Douglas. Picks it up. Madujan out wide to bail. Round one. He's going. He's still going. Finesse it. Bail. Oh, what a save. Bail. Tap it in. Yes, and it's 1 0. Bit of a scrappy goal, but we'll take it. 1-0 up, 3 and 4 minutes in the game, and that's one upgrade for the team so far. That's what we want to see. Triangled it round him, now it's into Vieto, he's played it over towards Rafinha. Rafinha, oh my god, oh my god, oh what a goal. That strength from Rafinha to get the ball, not only outmuscle the defenders, but get around two people to get to the ball. Don't know how it's done, and then he's taken the time to just lace it or finesse it around the keeper. Sorry, it's 2 0, 13 minutes on the clock. Bakambu into Vieto, he plays it back to Bakambu. Bakambu, see, I see you, Bale. Oh, it's a good touch, Bale. Oh, it's a good finish, he's just offside. Rafinha in the middle, Medujian, Medunjanin, whatever. He shoots, oh my god. What a goal by our CDM. <laughs> He's got that 83 shot power. Absolute beauty of a goal. And I have to check his long shots out as well, assuming as his free kit stats are good. But it's a great finish, and it's I make it 3-0. That's beautiful. Back Hambu. Oh, and Vieto finishes. 4-0. Lovely little flick. What a nice goal. Very cheeky. Bit of a sweaty goal, but look at that. Drills it across and Vieto with a decent little dink. 4-0. So guys, that's half time with 61% possession, 18 shots, 11 on target, 4 goals, 96 pass accuracy. I'm loving the feel of this team so far. He's not had a chance. I want to see a rage quit. I don't think I'm going to see one soon as we're already 4-0 up. So I might just ease off, let the game go out and um, try and just not concede, because we can't concede here. So let's go into the second half. Bale on the edge. Madujan volley at first time. Oh, it's gonna, it was going in. It's a beautiful shot. What is going on here? We can't get it out. He can't get it out, sorry. Oh, God. Right, so we'll hit it onto the edge. We've got Madujan who hits it on the volley. Oh, my God, it's in. This Mendun Janin is an incredible player. Fair enough, it's been deflected. It was probably going in, but it's an absolute beauty of a strike on the volley. Goes down as an own goal, but we'll take it. 5 0. Vieto's still going. Vieto with the finesse shot, and it's 6. Beautiful. Beautiful goal. Beautiful finish. Build up was incredible. Team is just feeling amazing. And Bale's now not as much as an influence as he as he was to start off with, just because we've got those better players around him. Bale starts to move off, and he's fuck. He's oh, that's a horrendous tackle. He's taken us out. It's got to be down to ten men. That's an awful challenge. Yep, yeah, red card down to ten men. 
90 minutes on the clock now. Just give us the end of the game because I don't think he wants it. He doesn't want to. He doesn't want to continue either. Oh my God! What a goal! Scored another seven nil. What a finish by Rafinha! Beautiful goal. He literally just gets ball rolled in the middle, plays it into Rafinha's feet, and he's just, he's just, oh, he's just placed it. It's beautiful. So, guys, it's finally half, uh, full time. I eased off in the second half, but we still managed to score three. I was taking more long shots or good shots just to, you know, make the in gameplay a bit more interesting. We'll have a look at the stats and see how well we actually did. Um, so Vieto got man of the match because he scored. Well, he scored two. And I think he got a, he got an assist as well. I think it should have been Rafinha. Two goals and two assists for Rafinha, but one upgrade for the goal and one upgrade for the win. Yep, two upgrades for this one. The team feels amazing. One player that uh, really surprised me was that Med Medun Janin, and he is just unreal. Um, felt like such a good player. Got great volleys, great shooting, and he's a great CDM. So. Um, I definitely recommend trying him. So let's go and see who we can buy for the team. So guys, before I show you the two upgrades we're going to do, I just wanted to show you a screenshot because I skipped past it before of the game we just played. I had I had 31 shots, 21 on target, 60% possession, 90% uh, pass accuracy, and he had no shots on goal. I just... That is just one of the biggest games I've ever dominated. And please leave a like if if, if you agree. Um, I know the support on this channel has been very good recently and I'm really happy. So I want to thank you as well. So let's go into the upgrades to show you then. Uh, I've gone and bought Ferreira Carrasco for left wing to bring out Bakambu, who played three games, scored one, got one assist. Good record, but we, we you know, got to get through to the... Uh, non-red golds. I uh, did not want to change the midfield yet either because this Med Medun Janin is brilliant. I wanted at least one more game with him. And then Dai, he was a solid player as well. Uh, and then at left back, we've gone and bought Johnny from Celta Vigo and we're going to replace him here. He's got 81 pace, 77 defending and 73 physical, which is a nice card to have in there as well. So guys, this is the team. Let's go into the second game of the episode and see how we get on. Let's go. Right guys, so our second opponent we've come up against is a 4-4-2 team with the majority of bronze players. He's got Javi Martinez and Ben Asher at the back with Gertz uh, in the midfield. Um, I don't know the rest of the players anyway, but let's go in. Let's get a win uh, and try and keep that clean sheet. Let's go. Comes into the middle. Mendun Janin hits it with his left. Oh my god! Oh my god, what a strike. I was not expecting that. I was expecting it to go on target. That is just an in incredible goal. What a finish. Oh my god. Another goal from our CDM. That's 1 0. Bit of breathing space that we wanted. Middle to Medun Janin again. Oh, he's taking him out. Ref. Get the yellow out. Come on. Oh my god, he sent him off. Mario Goetze is off. His only outlet. He's been sent off. Oh, it's a nice flick by Rafinha to Douglas. Back to Rafinha. It's blocked. Corner ball. Bail to take. We see you this time. This is going straight to him. Fene Fene oh, no, it's Carrasco, though. Gives it to Koloski. Or whatever, however you say it. And our centre-back has scored. It's 2-0. 27 minutes on the clock. Comfortable now. Bit of breathing space. He's a very good opponent. It's just his team is letting him down. And it's a great finish for Carrasco in the middle to Vieto. Dinks it. Bale header. Oh. It's gone to no one. Got to stop doing that. Johnny. Johnny. And it's three. Our left back on his debut does a bit of trickery and places it into the goal. 3-0. 35 minutes on the clock. And we're flying. That's what you want to see. Look at the ball roll. Ball roll again. Round the player. Mason will dive and just slots it in. 
but he's played it short again, and this time Carrasco's won it again. He sees Bale. Bale comes on in. Finesse it. Come on. Yes. Bale finally gets on the score sheet. 4-0. 43 minutes on the clock. And that is what we want to see. Not only have we got to upgrade with Bale, finally, but we're winning 4-0 quite comfortably. We've just got to make sure we do not concede because we do not want to lose an upgrade. Let's go. Into Vieto. We just need Bale to make that run. But it's Medun Janin again. He's making the run. He's dinking it. He's dinking it. Oh, my God. No way. Second goal for Medun Janin again in this game. And it's an absolute beauty. Beautiful chip. 5-0. It's only, it's only just coming up to half-time. But this is beautiful. It is incredible. What a finish. Oh, is that a pause? It's a pause. Can we get a rage quit? Come on. Give us the rage quit. Yes. So, guys, we... Don't get man of the match with Bale. We got uh, an upgrade for the win, an upgrade for the rage quit, and one upgrade for the goal with Bale. Three upgrades to finish off this episode. And I tell you what, I'm loving this team. Let's go and see who we can bring in. <laughs> so in that game, guys, even more domination. 17 shots, 10 on target, 68% possession, and it was 90% pass accuracy. That is such a good record to have. All right, let's go and see who we can buy. So guys, I've gone out and I've gone and I thought I'm not. I don't want to take Medun Janin out. He's played two games and scored three goals for us. He's got incredible all-round stats. I just want to keep him in the team for as long as possible. Just get as much enjoyment out of him as possible. Um, so I decided that we would upgrade one of the centre backs, uh, and I decided that I would. It's so difficult to choose between the two of them, but we're gonna keep the six foot. Um, we're gonna keep with the six foot one guy, just because he's slightly taller and he's a better rating. Um, and we're gonna bring in Martinez, who's a um, sixty-eight paced, eighty-one defending, eighty-two physical centre back who looks very good. I've had him on my main account, and he's solid at the back. So we'll bring in him, and then we're gonna make the change of taking out Rico and bringing in Kalo Navas. Um, Rico, the only place he is better is his kicking. Um, but he was very solid. We've had him for three games. Didn't concede. Um, very good keeper. Probably could have been tested a little bit more in the last two games, seeing as he didn't get any shots at him. But it was a good, good, good player anyway. Let's bring in Kalo Navas. And guys, our team is looking incredible now. Uh, I'm really enjoying this series. I hope you guys are as well. Uh, please leave a like if if you enjoyed it. If you're new around here, please subscribe. As you've seen, guys, I haven't got the majority, a lot of coins at the moment. So uh, when we move on to the rare golds, they may be the cheaper option to start off with, and then maybe change it into a we win the division when we have enough money, we bring in a better player, and we just keep playing with the team to get up to that division one because that's one of our tasks anyway. So yeah guys, this is me ending this episode for this one. I'll bring out the next one uh, tomorrow. Really want to thank you all for the support on it. Have a great day. Please leave a like and subscribe. And I'll see you all guys next time. See you later.